All right, we've got here a Nobles SS5 floor scrubber. And we have these units uh, in stock in 24, 28, and 32 inches. This particular one is a 24 inch wide machine. We'll show you some of the features of it. Uh, we start with the control panel. It's a very easy to use control panel. We have the brush pressure deck switch uh, that allows you to run the cleaning brushes down to the floor and as you're moving along you'll be able to control the brush pressure as you watch that gauge you want to keep that into the green if you get into the red you're putting wear on the motors and you, you can trip the circuit breakers as well uh, you have a easy to read battery discharge meter you want to make sure that that's staying into the green I'll let you know how much charge you have left on your batteries as we look down at the bottom of the machine, we have a squeegee assembly that comes off very easily with two knobs. Squeegee blades come on and off and are changed easily with a no tools required squeegee retainer band. And most of these machines that we have come equipped with an onboard charger. So this one can be plugged in anywhere that you have 110 volt power. At the back of the machine, you can also drain your dirty water out have the uh, vac hose there going down to the squeegee. Alright, let's take a look at the battery compartment. As you can see we've got four batteries makes up the 24 volt system so you've got four six volt batteries in series uh, here's where your circuit breakers are for your vacuum and two brush motors and your vac motor is mounted there anytime you're charging the machine you want to put it in the charge position there's a little keeper that will allow the battery gases to vent out while you're charging. Alright, we have different options for the cleaning brushes and pad drivers that we can use. Here we have these on the left. These are brushes that can be used for concrete. That is a blue poly brush. It's a nice average cleaning material for most applications. We can also set your machine up with pad drivers. Here we see pad drivers with red pads on them. The pads are retained on with a pad clip. We'll show you how that these are installed onto the machine. In this situation we have VCT tiles, so we're going to go with the pad drivers. These pop on the machine by pushing straight up and the drivers are attached to the gimbals on the motors. They also come off pretty easy. There's a little plunger there that you push down. The pad drivers just pop right off. Very easy. It just takes a few seconds to change out your pads or your brushes. Okay, now we have our pad drivers installed. It's time to fill our machine with water to get ready for scrubbing. We filled our water in the front. Their clean water opening is right there. You'll add your water and the correct amount of detergent that you're using per the directions of your particular product. Here we have our recovery lid. Before we use the machine, make sure that the vac float shut off is properly installed. That's what it will shut the vacuum down if you do happen to fill the tank over its capacity. When you go to dump the machine out, you have the drain hose there at the back of the machine. You also have another convenient way to fill the machine with clean water. As you're backed into your mop bucket sink or your janitor's closet, you'll be able to dump and fill, refill with clean water right there. Let's go ahead and turn the machine on. We'll show you the operation of it. We'll run the brush deck down. We'll also turn our vacuum on. drives with two trigger switches that your index finger controls. They're very easy to use. You also have a convenient speed control knob right there by your right index finger. 
if you need to back up, there's a reverse button. Always make sure to lift the squeegee assembly up before you back up. You need to go forward again, put it back down, continue driving forward. The solution control knob is at the bottom left of the machine. We have it set at full blast water, pull the way counterclockwise. It's full water all the way clockwise. Your water is, is turned to low. If you have any questions, feel free to call us. Our number is 501-844-1811 or check us out on our website, floor-scrubber.com. If you have questions, not sure which type of machine you need, not sure if you need brushes or pad drivers or what type of brushes you need, or maybe you're not sure what size machine you need, we have information on our site that can help you. Or feel free to reach out to us anytime with your questions. We'd love to be able to help you out.